Hi, I'm Scott Schaefer from Bishopsgate Golf Academy and I'm going to go over some simple putting drills, a setup drill, and how you can use a simple yardstick to improve your putting. Uh, so what we see with a lot of juniors when they set up to a putt, we see what we call floating elbows. So you'll see in the backstroke, you'll see a lot of space between the right arm and then on the way through, you'll see a space between their left arm. So their elbows float kind of this way and they're not really controlling the stroke with their upper body and the stroke tends to be too rounded start lines not really good so if you hold your putter horizontal to the ground grip it and you'll start to get your elbows against your rib cage you'll notice that the putter shaft and my forearms are parallel to the ground so if I turn to the side you'll start to see that if I hinge the putter up it's right in front of my nose and that'll help your start line because that's where the putter is going to come back to square every single time. So then get your feet about shoulder width apart. Hold the putter up, get your elbows against your side. Now you're going to make strokes with your upper body in the air horizontal to the ground. And you'll notice how the putter works square to the arc and your hands stay the same height. So once again from the side, the putter shaft horizontal to the ground, grip the putter. Get your elbows against your rib cage. Stand nice and tall. Feet about shoulder width apart. Then make strokes with your upper body, feeling that your elbows have a little bit of pressure against your rib cage. And that'll take care of the floatiness of your elbows and drifting of the grip. And you'll notice that you'll start the ball way more online, and hopefully, you'll hold some more short putts.